Before the procedure, my back would hurt a lot. I went to the zoo once and every like five or so minutes, I would have to sit down because my back would hurt a lot. I got an email from Atlantic Health uh, about uh, a doctor that was going to speak on scoliosis. And to me, it was God sent. So when I met Samantha, so she had a 53 degree right thoracic scoliosis, which is a fairly big curve. Because of the degree of the curve, there's a real risk of that curve getting worse as she gets older because she was also very skeletally immature. She hadn't stopped growing yet. In certain curves, the curves are already beyond what we can treat with conservative strategies. So typically, we want to talk about doing either bracing, possibly with therapy methods to try to address the scoliosis. There is a newer treatment option available, which is called vertebral body tethering, which is a flexible attempt to try to correct scoliosis and maintain it in a corrected position. When we got here and met Dr. Lowenstein, he explained everything, both the rods and the tethering. The biggest benefit of vertebral body tethering, if it's successful, is that you're maintaining motion. You're not fusing the spine, so it's a flexible way to try to correct the scoliosis. To go from what she was to even what she is now, and it's not even a year. What a transformation. One of the big questions is always, is it safe to operate on the spine? And families and patients are oftentimes worried about how we place our hardware and we're placing so close to the spine. We use an intraoperative CT scan called Aero that allows for a true CT scan to be performed in the operating room. And then we use that to navigate all of our instrumentation so we have real-time live information helping us guide exactly where we're putting our hardware. So the screws are always placed in the perfect place, really with literally millimeter accuracy. Um, so it's never been safer. You do see your back start to strain out and I was really happy. I was actually in a concert for choir and I stood up the entire time. When you find that right doctor that you can trust and you know that this is the right guy or right girl, that's how you know that your life will be better. He's amazing, absolutely amazing. I mean, she's even talking about wanting to take surfing lessons. Since I had to put all that stuff off for so long, my body's like, what is it like? It's been so long. Go do more stuff. I have been more active than I have been in two years. It's amazing. I mean, to see her walk in and, and be pain free and her curve is fixed and she's back to all of her normal activities, it's unbelievably gratifying. Scoliosis is something that can absolutely be treated successfully and kids can go back to a normal life after they have their curves fixed and there's really no limitations. I mean, there's nothing Samantha can't do. I think the future is incredibly bright for the treatment of scoliosis. I think kids are doing better and better. I think it's wonderful. And I think parents and, and, and children that are uh, dealing with scoliosis and living with this and trying to come up with strategies to treat it, they should feel very confident that there's great options available to them.